Hey everybody, welcome to another review. Uh, I'm gonna do two today. First one I'm gonna do is I decided uh, I haven't done a, a McAfee review in a while, so I went and downloaded the, their Total Protection Suite, whatever you want to call it. Went uh, installed it. Got all the updates. It's uh, stock from the factory. Got the updates at 10:29. Just want to show you real quick what kind of uh, memory usage we have here. It's pretty high though. Um, let's see what we got here. 33 megs, 15, 8, 1. Uh, so that's what? 50? A little over 50, 50 to 60 megs. Just sitting there not doing anything. That's awfully high. But, you know, whatever they want to do. So I got some links here. get started on doing this review these are all fairly new you know like I always get the links definitely tell you the computer is a little bit slower and it installs its little toolbar deal and looks like that website's dead Uh, this is a PDF, and I don't have any PDF anything installed yet, so I'm going to skip that one. So far, okay, here we go. I got something from the uh, little toolbar they got here, Reputation. Okay, and there you go. It deleted and automatically removed a Trojan. Huh? Okay, so I got that one. And I got rid of that one. Don't see anything happening there. Okay, looks like I didn't do anything for that one. Oh, look at all those fun things. Explorer crashed, Internet Explorer crashed. Yeah, definitely some things happened. We'll go back to the home page here. And just we'll keep going. I think these are might be a couple of rogues, if I remember right. Yep. AC Commander, whatever that is. Oh, look. Got rid of that one. Mm, we've still got a link for it here. The AC Commander again. I think I might have accidentally got the same link twice. Okay, what do we got there? Okay, this is uh, about the uh, the website. We'll allow it for now and see if the actual program will catch something. Doesn't look like it. Come on, you. And this is 
was the last one. I think this might be another rogue type program or Trojan or Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is because I got a little time, I'm going to run a scan here. Let's see where did they put that stupid scan? There it is. We're on a quick scan. I don't have time to wait for it because I'm sure it's going to take a while. So um, I'll pause the video now and I'll let it do its scan and we'll see if it finds anything. Uh, right now I'm not really impressed with uh, McAfee, especially because it's a paid program. It's not free or anything. So, All right, we'll see what it finds and then I'll come back and run Hitman Pro and if we have some time maybe I'll do some malware bytes too. All right, see you in a sec. Okay, real quick. Um, while I was scanning here, guess uh, what I got? What I found? I found that new copyright violation uh, Trojan deal, where uh, it f tells you that you have uh, some uh, program detected, and uh, you're uh, oh, there you go, McAfee finished. I found nothing, and uh, they want you to settle in a pretrial order. So if you click on that. It uh, tells you how much it costs to to settle, and you give them your credit card, and they steal your credit card information. So it's kind of funny. I'm sure it, a lot of people fell for it. So it's n it's not just funny; it's just stupid. Some of these, you know, people who write malware, they have nothing better to do, um, and you can see it's just all about money. They don't care how they trick you, and that's one of the reasons why you need a really good antivirus for things like that not to be able to get on your computer and then you to freak out or something and give them your credit card information and then somebody steals your identity and it just everything goes to you know what. Alright, so I'll be back after uh, Hitman Pro finishes the scan. See you in a sec. Okay, so Hitman Pro finished uh, scanning here, and you can see there's a bunch of stuff. Um, we got that uh, AP Manager, which is, uh, or we know that it's uh, something, uh, even though it says it's suspicious, it's a very new file. Uh, we have some temporary internet files, which aren't right now that big of a deal. We got a temp file here, which, you know, could be a something. Some more temporary internet files here, uh, and uh, we got some stuff right here. We got Trojan, that other Trojan, uh, that fake AV thing, I think it was this AC commander, and uh, DL here. <clears throat> so definitely this is a fail, in my opinion, for uh, McAfee. They need to do a lot better if they want to keep customers. Um, at this point in time, I personally would not recommend this. I wouldn't I wouldn't put it on any computer. Uh, it's just it's not provide enough protection against today's malware. So that's it on this review. Um, I'm going to let you guys go. I got one more to do, and I'll talk to everybody later.